to see you again. Nice to see you. Uh, Angie Harmon, new show yes. Yes. with you. It, it, the, the name is a little tricky. Did anyone say that? <laughs> you don't think the names Rizzoli and Isles yeah. are simple? Yeah. No, it's tricky. When are you going to change it to Sasha and Angie? <laughs> <laughs> I know. I, I'm quick that way. That's, that's, actually, that's actually a good idea. So you guys, uh, tell me about this scene. You were doing something with a, uh, a corpse or a dead, a dead person or an actor or what was going on? Well, we work with a lot of actors playing dead bodies. Mm -hmm. So if you ever wondered if the dead bodies on a crime show are dead, they're not. Right. <laughs> so uh, they are playing dead bodies. And so we had this gentleman who had to die. And we had a, uh, not had to die, but had to pretend he was dead. Right. Yes. And are we we're in very the show? real. Yes. It's very real. Yeah. And so we, um, we had a scene over him. So let's say this is him. Sure. We had to have this argument over his body. I'll be Angie. OK, you be Angie. OK. And we put a blanket over his body, mm. and we, we're arguing. And while we're arguing, we're putting the blanket down on him. And after an hour of shooting it and 20 takes later, Angie comes up to me and says, oh my gosh, we have been hitting his jaw the entire time. <laughs> This is, this is uh, I think we could say that the uh, make love you area, right? The make, yeah. Below the belt. Now, what, now is this out of habit or how does this work? I, I, I mean. It happens to everybody. Yeah. No, um, no, you know what? My we, kind of gals. Yeah. No, I'm kidding. No, but it was, you know, poor guy. I mean, yeah. poor guy. Well, poor lucky guy. I don't yeah. know. It depends how you look at it. Um, and then, and then uh, so then he maybe becomes a speaking part one day because he's such a good sport. Well, um. In this case, he was such a good sport for a few days because he had to do a lot of other really uh, difficult things, yeah. you know, drinking fake blood and spitting it up, and it goes up in his eyes and his nose. And he never complained. He was so lovely that we told the producers they've got to give him a speaking part. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Stay with us. Five questions, and we come back with Sasha Alexander. <laughs> Alexander from the new TNT show, Sasha and Angie. Uh, so let's see, your, your mother-in-law, this is amazing. Your, tell them who your mother-in-law is. Sophia Loren. That's a true story. Yeah, we can clap for her. Well, let's talk about your mom. Yes. Now, what was that? Uh, well, you grew up and she did some weird things concerning sunbathing. Um, well, yes, my mother used to, when I was young, put olive oil on our skin. In lieu of... Sunscreen, sunscreen because she didn't believe in sunscreen no she doesn't she doesn't believe in sunscreen she's always said that it causes strange things yeah. and... my parents did crisco even though they could afford olive oil because it's a long story and i won't use the word frugal but they're like that are you ready for five qu it's time for five questions Start with geography. I don't want you to look at the screen because we're putting this. You have to spell something. You're from Serbia. Spell the NBA player Darko Milicic. D A R K O Milicic. Yeah. M I L I C E V I C. Maybe I said it wrong. Milicic? What if it ended I C at the end? What would it be? Look over there. How did I? Oh. <laughs> Milicic. Mil uh, yeah. Did I say it wrong? It's Milicic. Yeah. M I L I C. I said it wrong. C. You're correct. I said it wrong. Woo! One down. <laughs> Boy, that was good. Uh, in 2009, what was the 17th most popular name given to baby boys in 2009? 2009? Noah. Incorrect. Uh, Alexander. Oh, really? Yeah, isn't that fun? Oh, okay. <laughs> You're an actress. Look at the camera. Let's see your fake sneeze. Fake sneeze. And action. <laughs> Very good. Yes. <laughs> the double, the wind-up. The one, yeah, the wind-up. Uh, in your new television series, you play a medical examiner. Within six, how many bones are in the adult human body within six? Oh, that is embarrassing. Yeah. It's, it's a big number. It is? Yeah, it's, really? it's like up a, there. Like a hundred uh, and double, something? Double that. Really? Two hundred? Yes, within six. It's 206. Very good. <laughs> Compensating for Wendy Malik, I didn't help Wendy enough. Now I'm just holding her hands around here. Well, this is a tough one. Ten seconds on the clock. You performed in Shakespearean festivals in the past. I need you to name four Shakespearean comedies in ten seconds. Go. 
Twelfth Night, Midsummer Night's Dream, uh, Much Ado About Nothing, uh, Love Labor's Lost. Yes, was that four? Yeah. I believe she got. Is that five Woo! out of five? Is that thank you? Four out of five. Four out of five? Oh, oh, you got, you got, you got. No, you got four out of five. Yeah. Oh, you, I got five. You missed five. Noah. Oh, okay. You missed Alexander. Missed Noah. It's a forgettable name. No, it's not. It's a great name. <laughs> Rizzoli and Isles. Yes. Uh, Sasha Alexander. Great to see you again, young Good lady. To see you. Uh, let's see, Yvette Nicole Brown from Community and Matt Walsh from all those movies, including The Hangover. That's our show. Thank you, Christine. We'll see you next time. So long, everybody.